Our Fit Kids Fit Families campaign is all about the fight against childhood obesity. And a big part of that is finding time to cook healthy meals at home. The Georgia Food Industry Association is trying to make it a little easier for you with a new website called Eat at Home Georgia. You can download a grocery list, a weekly menu planner, and lots of recipes. The program's director says eating at home can be easy, but it's all a matter of planning. You work late and you haven't, you haven't planned, so you end up driving through somewhere and the amount of calories you consume by doing that is just horrible. So we're just trying to help you get organized so when you walk in the door you'll have your, your meals ready to go. Eating at home can also save you a lot of money and it can be a lot healthier than eating out since you control the ingredients and portion sizes. And if you thought cooking all of your meals at home is overwhelming, you're certainly not alone. You're about to meet a busy mom who's juggling a career, a baby, and a blog, all while learning to cook. This mom is on a mission to eat at home more often, get healthier, and set a good example for her son. During the legislative session, Jacqueline Newman spends her days lobbying for the Georgia food industry. Georgia food, this is Jacqueline. But up until a few months ago, she didn't know her way around a grocery store. I couldn't find the scallions. Scallions, the same thing as a green onion, but they don't tell you that. So at 32 years old, this working mom set off on a journey to better health for her whole family. Georgia has an epidemic in childhood obesity, and, um, you know, we just feel as parents that we need to start setting examples at an early age so that he can continue um, with a healthy lifestyle as he grows up. Jacqueline started a blog called Mom on a Mission. Her first goal, to eat out less and eat at home more. Just one little problem. Honestly, I don't know how to cook <laughs> at all. But Jacqueline conquered her fears in the kitchen by starting a cooking club with her friends. And every weekend, they get together and prepare a few simple meals to divide amongst the group. And then all they have to do is pop them in the oven and dinner's served. The great thing is, is that you're practicing portion control. The bad thing is, is that if you're hungry, there's not any anymore. <laughs> Despite the challenges, Jacqueline's plan is working. So far, she's lost about a third of the weight she gained while pregnant with her 11-month-old son. And her family is growing closer, too. We, ha we spend more quality time together. Uh, you know, we put on some music and start chopping vegetables or, or whatever that may be. Um, we've started doing, you know, walks around the neighborhood. All right, pumpkin. Through her blog, Jacqueline hopes to inspire other busy moms to lead a healthy and balanced lifestyle. Her advice? Make sure you have a strong support system. How was your day? And don't give up, even when the mission seems impossible. This is not just you know, a short-term project. This is a lifestyle change. To follow Jacqueline on her journey, go to cbsatlanta.com. Click on Fit Kids under the Better Health tab. Then scroll down and click the link that says Eat at Home, Georgia. And if you know of a program or an event that encourages kids and families to get fit, send an email to fitkids at cbsatlanta.com and we will put it on our Fit Kids calendar. And be sure to join us every Friday for our Fit Kids segments right here on CBS Atlanta News.